Mr. Chairman, once again, we reluctantly have to raise the discrimination the Baha'is in Qatar are facing, a discrimination which is solely based on their religious beliefs and which, if it persists, will lead to the elimination of this religious minority from Qatar's shores. Baha'is have resided in Qatar for over 70 years. Nevertheless, they have never been recognized as a community, making the operation of their personal and community affairs very challenging. Moreover, individual Baha'is have been denied certificates of good conduct, which are necessary for employment solely because of their religious beliefs. Other Baha'is are blacklisted, which has led to their residency permits being terminated or not renewed, and to the deportation along with their families. Even Qatari Baha'is have been obliged to leave when their spouse has been denied residency. The only aspiration of the Baha'i community in Qatar is to be allowed to contribute to the welfare of their country while practicing their basic rights as a religious minority without fear of deportation. But the Qatari authorities have not been responding to their long-standing pleas. Qatar is now a member of the Human Rights Council, and it is timely that it addresses the question of the rights of the Baha'is instead of avoiding it through false excuses or silence. Thank you.